Welcome back to the Sindora channel. I am Travis. This is Two Point Hospital. We have uh, four hospitals done. We learned about how heaters work in, in Tumble. And now we're heading over to the Mitten University. It says it's going to be cold here too. Mitten University. We'll only be able to recruit students, doctors, and nurses here, so we'll need to train them up. Firstly, they'll need a research license. The ministry will grant us one if we can demonstrate our technical prowess by establishing a hospital with some upgraded machinery. Okay, heckin' go time. They give us this little rectangle here. Rooms, items, reception. Put the reception right there so it's nice and cluttered. This uh, door right there. Yeah, that's just fine. Filing cabinet and a bin. We're back doing exactly what we were doing on the last episode, building a hospital. And they want a radiator because everyone's everyone's very cold. Oh, we could put a sonic rug in the GP's office? Yeah. And then the poster. You can't have a rug without your poster. Rooms. Yes, we're not open yet. They're freaking out because we don't have staff, but that it makes sense why, why we don't have any. Fire extinguishers, hand sanitizer, a radiator, a plant next to the radiator, then a sonic poster. Okay, let's hire some people. We need a a doctor, and we need a janitor, a really good janitor. Then rooms, we should probably get some training going, huh? Put that here, and just put the chairs wherever. Sure, that doesn't matter. Can train six people. Oh, sorry, just wanted to move the trash can. It's in an ugly spot, but at least it's, at least it's centered. A plant and a poster. We need to diagnostic, we should we should train our doctors on how to do that. It costs 10,000, so we're gonna hire another doctor then to stand around and hire another nurse to stand around. Uh, we should get some benches so our customers don't have to stand around patients. Sorry. I, I grew up with them being called customers, so... That's what I call them. One of our patients has been sent to our diagnostic room. 60%! Uh... Send them to the treatment. Oh, it's another 60%? Send them to treatment. 60% sure with no college degree. How can you be 60% sure? Well, when I said 50% sure, everyone freaked out. But when I said 60%, all of a sudden everyone was like, I'll, I'll take the risk. It's a nice toilet. Is that going to be big enough? I've been making the bathrooms too big lately, so... Face painting clowns! at the circus for everyone! More two point, more often. This is two point ah, radio. Next to the radiator. Very cute bathroom. Uh, fifty four percent. Send him to treatment. Some more rooms. We have our pharmacy. Just need a general diagnostics office. There's your easy scan. Nice little filing cabinet. The easy machine definitely looks like it'll set itself on fire. Don't bump your knee on that. We almost forgot the sonic poster. Does the bathroom have a sonic poster? Right up against that radiator. That'll leave a nice yellow stain on it over time. How expensive is this room? 10,000? We'll copy it. Give us... Give us one more. Can we rotate that actually? Move the door somewhere else. Beautiful. So we need pharmacy management. You're gonna learn how to do that. And we're gonna pay 10,000 for that? Fine. Probably hire some more then. I know we're gonna be running out of money real quick. And then diagnostics would be good. Get two of those and we'll pay the we'll pay the ten thousand. When we upgrade this uh, this pill dispenser, uh, we'll we'll get our research license. But generally happy. Research unlocked. Rooms. Scroll down to the bottom. We got research, everybody. We're gonna we're gonna search for something and hope that someone else has already searched for it, so then we can just. Uh, Research it. Beautiful. You can have three people in there researching. Fire extinguisher in case it all comes apart. Radiator in case they get cold. And a sonic poster in case they need something to look at. Oh, we're so close to level three though. <laughs> we're looking for a doctor. Average height, white coat, answers to doctor. If you see someone like that. What is that? Does that mean you're gonna die in, in 200 seconds? Further diagnosis, willing to wait 200 seconds. Okay, so we're gonna need another one of these. Copy it. Put it right there. Oh, and that could be a four room. I'll yeah, put it here. Put that there, facing this way. This is the don't look at me room. You can hear your doctor's voice, but it's just you separated by radiators. Filing cabinet and a poster. Doc, I'm feeling like I'm seeing this poster all over the place. 
Doctor's like, I don't know, I've never seen that poster a day in my life. I'm, in I'm inclined to not believe you, Doctor. Let's uh, complete promotherapy research. That's what it's telling us to do. Start project, click on the room. Staff, extra staff, optional. Make that priority high. See how fast they do that, are we making money still? We are still making money, so I'll send another doctor there. Oh yeah, actually. There? Actually, yeah. Yes, yes. Lazy bones. It'll cost 7,500 7, to build a ward. No, send the patient home. Helicopter came in a little quick. Cool, we have research room, but we don't have doctors with the research qualifications. Oh, they're not done. Oh, because they sent them all there. Damn it. Okay, can this one teach people how to... You're gonna learn how to research, and you're gonna learn how to research, and that's gonna cost us $10,000, but we don't have the money. We talked last time about taking out a loan. Please respect the hospital grounds. No unauthorized digging. Loans. Here, you can take out a loan. At 5%. Are we making 2,000? No, we're losing 4,000. So if we spent more money while we're not making that much money, how would you expect? <laughs> Are we gonna lose? We gotta take out a loan. We gotta. Okay, we have no doctors, but we've got lots of people uh, in training. We don't have a ward yet. Even if we wanted one and could afford it, we can't because we don't have a doctor that knows how to do it. You wanna raise? Fine. Okay, there's the ward. It's not very big. Oh, we can't afford to bed, because we're still losing money. Did I build too many classrooms too quick? Can we sell one of these? What happens if you sell it? It's worth 9,000? Yeah. Point radio. Fear not, faithful listeners. Your favorite sell radio it. personality, yeah. Sir Nigel Dickelworth, okay. is back. As much as I would now we can barely afford the ward. Booth forever, oh, but I, I just cannot that. deprive you of my wit. I do want it to be able I to be take big. the responsibility of being your only source of intellectual stimulation very seriously indeed. More instantly forgettable melodies coming up next. <laughs> Training course completed. Training course complete. That is good news. For lots of reasons. There we go. Good deal. A little hand sanitizer. That poster. What are we... What are we missing? It's not money, right? Oh, it was money. I thought we were building them as we went. Oops. Delixing? No. Mm, psychiatry? Seven patients? No. Yes. Okay. Raise? Promote. That's why the uppers love us. Because we, 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 we just skim, skim the paperwork. So we can move this over there. I can move this over there. But why would I? Why, why do we do that? Edit. But we're gonna. Just gotta move that door when we're done. Here. Oh, I guess it has to stay there for a second. Poster was in the way, so. Ah, uh, we can't afford a door. Is it because we're so busy paying off our loan? Are there cheats for this game? Not that we want to use them. Ah, oh, man, we just went really red. <laughs> Our year in review. Well, uh, yeah, cancel the room. I can't afford it, so. <laughs> you guys watch that stuff come up, and I'll I'll Google the, the cheats, if there are any. Okay. So there's mods, but there's no cheats, which is fine. Open them all. You got the same rewards. No debts? I guess we weren't taking on a lot of critical patients. Promotion. I know we don't have the money to pay you, but we're gonna pretend like we do all the way up to the end. We're making money. We're profitable right now. 4,000. Now can we move this? Will it, does it cost a lot of money to move it? Here, move this door. There. We could even shorten this room a little bit. Not that that would help a lot. The hospital may well be haunted. Then this could probably be moved too. I wanna move the whole room, please. I just put a room behind there. And that'll be all filled up here in a second. Who's gonna teach you to get back up on your feet if you never learn, if you never run? Put this right behind it so if you fall off, you get thrown into the radiator. That way we get repeat customers. Patience. I love how, how tight you can make the hallways. Everybody come on through. Train ourselves in research. There we go. 
so this is the view. If we could, I wish we could get down to like uh, person view, so we could look at. You walk in here, and it's just so cluttered. You're seeing the back of machines and cardboard clearly taped to the back of it. Do you think we need a loan? No. We should be. We're making twenty-one thousand. That's our profit. How are our loans? Thirty-one thousand we owe. Can I pay like half of that? Repay it. Now we have no money again. We completed our research. Send patient home. Accept it. Send patient home. Send patient home. Okay. All right. Now this is moving. Now we got people in here moving, moving gears and pushing buttons. They're doing a great job. Seven people waiting for this, and six people waiting for that. We'll get another one. There we want it. Right there. We did it! We researched a thing! So now we can, uh... uh chromotherapy is 21,000, so it's, uh, it's really expensive. Probably need to teach people about chromotherapy, right? No. No, why would we do that? So we're still making money, right? Yeah, 22,000k. So if we're, if we're patient while we build this... What does chromotherapy look like when they use it? I've, I've, I haven't seen this room. 15,000 left. It costs 21,000 to make the room. So... We'll just get our sonic poster, and then we'll wait. Has just invented a chromotherapy room, giving hope to those afflicted with gray anatomy. Oh, there's my chromotherapy patients. That room is gonna get really busy here for a bit. I can tell. Can't be centered. Centered with the door, though. Ah, uh, we don't have a nurse in there. Yeah, hire a nurse so we can train some nurses. General practices. Yeah, but those are doctors. We wanted nurses. A nurse and a doctor. That'll be worth it. Upfront fee is 10,000, tuition fee is 10,000 times two trainees, so it's 30,000. Guess we'll just wait to cure a patient in chromotherapy. We, we missed the first guy, but oh, he failed. He's back to color, but he, he has failed. All right, guy, get in there. Oh. We did it! One star. <laughs> Congratulations. Thanks. Train 10 staff, generate 2,000 research points, and cure 50 patients to get the second star, but you know how we're only ever trying to get one star until we need to forcefully go back. Dead patient in the corridor. Uh, what can I say about Flemington? With its beautiful winter gardens, its magnificent mansions, and its resident dukes, barons, and baronets. Well, I wish I could afford to live there for one thing. <laughs> but I guess I'll settle for a visit instead. A very short, very expensive visit. Dear Hospital, your organization shows great promise. And, as a result, has been chosen to take Yep, chosen to take part in a Bungle Superbug initiative. Ooh, that's teaching us about the bug? That's alright though. Are you ever just sitting there at work or home and you realize you're incredibly cold? What's the deal with that? Personally, I use radiators. So we have five stars total now. Flemington, a hospital in a wealthy town of Flemington. That's all, that's all we get. It's gonna be cold, people are gonna be really angry and they're gonna think because they're in a rich neighborhood that they get their hospitals for free, but we actually we actually charge them like 9,000%, which is, that's that's not too bad compared to what we could charge them. Thank you guys so much for watching. I super appreciate it. We'll see you in the next episode. See ya. On the recording date, it's, uh, it's April 20th. Happy 420, guys. I wish I was invited to a 420 party, but no one ever... No one ever invited me. What 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 do they what do they even do there? I'll Google it one second. Oh, it's drugs.